Hi, and welcome back to my channel. So today I have my this huge box, but I have my Transcend box. And as you can see, this box comes from the company Ever Eve. So very quickly, Transcend is a fashion subscription service and it is styled through the company Ever Eve. I live in the Northeast um, and specifically in New York and we don't have any Transcends in our state. So the closest to me would be either in New Jersey or in Connecticut. So I normally am so excited to order because I can still get clothes from this store, which I absolutely love, but I can't actually shop physically in the store. So being able to order through Trendsun is awesome. So this past year, I've ordered quite a bit with them. And the deal with Trendsun is once they, um, once you sign up, they normally will charge you a styling fee, but I have the style pass for this year. So my styling fee is normally just a dollar and that's through the end of the year. And also I get an extra 10% off on anything I order from that style pass. Also, if anyone uses my link, which I will put in the comments, I get an extra 20% off on top. And if you use the link, you get 20% off your first box and anything that you purchase out of your first box. So I'm going to tell you I slit this box open and a very, very quick story. So I think I mentioned that I had ordered um, a Wannable box. So I did a Wannable edit, home for the holidays edit. I had a Stitch Fix box for Christmas and I also had a Trunk Club for the month of December, um, a cozy um, themed box, like a more ath athleisure wear box. So I asked also for a Transcend and all of these boxes were due to come right around the same time. Um, I believe Stitch Fix and Wannable came the same day. Trunk Club, no, I'm lying. Wannable came um, at the beginning of my weekend. Stitch Fix and Tr uh, Trunk Club came uh, the same day, the same time on a Sunday. And this Transcend was supposed to be delivered Monday. And it was saying all along that it was going to be delivered by Monday at 9 o'clock. And Monday 9 o'clock came and went. And then all of a sudden I get this update. And by the way, this gets delivered by the mail. The rest came um, either UPS or FedEx. Nothing else came by the mail. This was supposed to be three-day priority mail and delivered to me. And long story short, when it got updated and I'm being told after that 9 p.m. cutoff, arriving late and no other update, nothing. Couldn't tell me where it was. So my younger brother knows someone in the post office and he mentioned it to him because I said to him, this has never happened to me. This is a little strange that there was no update. I mean, like I understand it's Christmas time. I understand the craziness of, you know, getting packages, whatever, but no update, wouldn't tell me where it was at that point, wouldn't, just arriving late. So he sent me a link to open a case for this box. I open the case and I fill out all the information and I ask to be notified by the phone, the status, what is going on, where is this box? Just let me know that it didn't get lost. I mean, I understand coming late, but I just wanna know um, that it didn't get lost. Because again, no further update as far as a location even where this box was. So I get this phone call and it's from Topeka, Kansas. Now again, I'm a New York girl. Um, I pick up, I, it's on my cell phone, that's what I gave. And it is the post office. And the lady tells me on the other line that she could not tell me where my package was and you have to understand this is Christmas time. I get that. She says to me, but from what I can see on my end, it could take another nine days for this package to come. Nine days. So I say nine days from the original ship date, which I believe was December 3rd, 
or nine days from today's date, which at that point was December 9th. She says to me, nine days from today, December 9th. I'm like, but this three day priority package and you can't even tell me where it could be sitting on a truck somewhere. We just don't know where it is. So I call Trendsend after I hang up with her because again, I'm not feeling so confident. Um, I guess I should be thankful because again, here's the box. But Trendsend told me, give it a chance, you know, wait it out. If I didn't get it by the beginning of the following week, they would act. So I did get it a day later. I know maybe that sounds like a crazy, crazy story, but long story short, I'm just happy I got my box. It came in one piece, not damaged. So without further ado, let's open this box. Again, sorry for the long drawn out story, but I just wanted you to know what I went to get this box, what I went through. I'm ecstatic. Um, this box actually, I believe, came from the warehouse and I cannot wait to see what's in this box. So I opened the box. I did not take anything out yet. So on top, if you could see it, it's my paperwork and it says, sorry if it's not coming in clearly. There we go. So it says attitude, gratitude, ready for your closet upgrade. And my note, I believe I have Simone G again. I've had her for a couple of times now. She says Janine and she put a heart. Um, happy Trend Sunday and happy December. The holiday season has begun and I hope you are happy, healthy and enjoying this special time of the year. This box was styled especially for you, so I hope it makes you smile and brings you some holiday cheer. I love getting feedback, so if you have time, let me know what pieces you loved, how things fit, and be sure to include information about any upcoming events or special items you need for your wardrobe. Have fun trying everything on. Cheers to you, Simone G. And she says, also, I've included coloring sheets for the girls. So, her note, she did include, looks like, um, some cute coloring sheets, looks like little girl ice skating, and same one, little girl ice skating. So two of the same sheets for my daughters. And I just put this here so I could explain to you. So again, I've used Trendsend and Every Eve. I actually ordered recently, um, I think I mentioned in another video, um, boots and also Spanx leggings. So sometimes I order directly from Ever Eve and sometimes I do Trendsend. So when you order and you spend a certain amount um, in a quarter, so usually it's like January, February is a quarter. This quarter I believe was September, October. So the next would be November, December of my spending. So it says your rewards are here, you get rewarded. So I got rewarded, I don't know if you can see it, but all of the money that I spent, and I don't know why it won't focus, come on. Um, I got rewarded $25. I'm gonna come closer, you can see it, if not, Again, I don't know why that's not focusing, but I got rewarded $25. So I can use any discounts I have in this box already. I can use this 25 towards taking off any final um, price adjustments at the end as well. So I've got $25 to spend on top of that. So like I said, this box came and was delivered by my postman and Anything I don't want gets returned right to Every Eve in this postal mailer and right back to the post office. So, um, looks like there are three, no, three bundles. Let's see if I can show you how it looks packaged wise. It's pretty heavy, but here is the box. 
has those heart stickers. We're gonna get right to the try on, but I will just show you the bundles real quick. I think gonna be, yes. Wow, this one is huge. So here's the first bundle with the little Ever Eve heart sticker. Um, looks like some jeans, white um, sweatshirt material, uh, thermal in probably like a blue color, tie dye pink. So that's bundle one. We also have another bundle with some more tie dye. Looks like some army green. Uh, maybe, I don't know if that's blue. I want to say it's like a navy color. And last bundle that I'm pulling out has some more green. Um, looks like a plum. Maybe like a dark purple color. Again, some more thermal, like gray and pink. I think this might be a graphic tee. It looks like there's like graphic print on it. So there are my bundles behind me. I'm going to get to opening them, but where did I put my paperwork? I just, one other thing I just wanted to show you inside of my stylist's note. And we're not going to go through that yet, but there is my price sheet. And then there is the items on the other side, but with the stylist's note, how to style them. So we are going to come back with that try on and have some fun. So stay tuned for that. Be back shortly. So I'm back. And yes, this is the fun part. This is where I get to try everything on that Simone G sent me my stylist. So, uh, the first outfit, this is outfit number one. Let me read her note first. She says, here is a comfy and oh so cute set to start off December right. Tackle that to-do list in comfortable style from shopping to decorating to wrapping and cooking. No matter how and what you celebrate, we all seem to want to do it up right this time of the year. The pullover and the tee will look great with all of your jeans, too. So, I have all three items on. There is a t-shirt underneath this sweatshirt. I'll take the sweatshirt off as soon as I show you the full jogger look. So, the jogger set, the you can see the print on the top, and I will pull back in a second, but the top and the bottom are both by Electric Rose. The um, top piece, the sweatshirt, is the Roman crest pullover, and the bottom, uh, when I back up, which m seems to be the matching set, is the um, Vedima jogger. So hang on, and then I will tell you about the t-shirt when I uh, take the sweatshirt off. But here is the top. It's kind of short, so like I said, I have the t-shirt on. If I pull my arms up, you are going to see, if I didn't have a t-shirt on, you'd see my belly a little. But I think this time of the year, I probably would wear something underneath. You know, it's cold. I'm not gonna lie, we had some flurries yesterday. Um, but the matching sweatpants, by the way, have a drawstring. I didn't tie, you can tie, um, but I didn't tie it at this point. But again, they are matching. I don't know if you can see the print. The print on the leg matches the print on the sweatshirt. So let me turn around so you can see the back. Again, back of the pants. Very, very comfortable and I wanna say a great fit. Like these fit me. I don't have, I'm gonna show you. Um, the t-shirt is like a front tuck, but no, no issue there in the back, no gaping. They just fit. They fit perfectly, I think, the whole outfit. Um, oh, and pricing. So the price of the pullover is $142.20 and the joggers, the matching joggers are also $142.20. So I'm not going to lie to you, very pricey. I don't know. Um, I have three other boxes here and I have other things in this box. 
I am looking for comfy cozy. I just don't know if I'm looking to spend that. But again, I do have the option. Um, my husband and my kids are going to give me some items for Christmas. So, you know, if, if I felt it necessary, maybe. But again, I, I had to give you the price tag. It is, this is a very pricey set. Um, oh, and the bottom of the joggers, it does have elastic down here. Um, nice. Cinches in elastic. Um, oh, pockets. I'm just trying to think of everything I could tell you. Now let me take off the sweatshirt so you can see the t-shirt. So the t-shirt has a Billy Joel, I believe, logo on it. So let's put this to the side a second. Okay. Just put that over there. Okay, so let me come closer so you can see the t-shirt. So I'm going to bring you down just a little, okay? So hang on. Okay, so I am back and I untucked the t-shirt so you could see it. And this t-shirt is the Billy Joel tee in the wash black color, extra small, by the company Let Love. And I do believe I have another t-shirt by them. I think it's my Rolling Stones um, graphic tee from Trendsend as well. And this one is $61.20. So just so you can see, it says Billy Joel in concert and the famous piano because Billy Joel is the piano man and long story short I've seen Billy Joel in concert quite a few times I live in New York I've seen him at Madison Square Garden a handful of times um I got very very lucky and I actually saw Billy Joel show up to a Paul McCartney concert that I saw here locally as well so I've seen Billy in concert numerous times and I do have a Billy Joel um, band tee, but I do like this one. The, it's in a navy color and then the pinks and the yellow star, like it's just cute. So um, yeah, I mean, definitely, definitely a cute band tee. You can see the length of it. Let me turn around so you can see the length in the back, same length in the back, just plain in the back, nothing, nothing special about it in the back, but that is and completes outfit number one. So let me do a wardrobe change and I'll be back with the next outfit. So hang on for that. So I'm back and this is outfit two, except there's so many different um, pieces in outfit two. So this is just the first part of outfit two. So I'll read her note. You are going to see in this part of the try on, um, another one of the graphic band tees and a pair of um, sweatpants, I believe. Um, I know what I'm wearing. I just joggers. I'm sorry. I have to get the terminology correct. But you are going to see a band tee and joggers. So she says the gray colored denim and gray joggers, both oh so soft and really comfortable. Each of these tops complement both bottoms. The joggers keep everything sporty and the denim dresses up. Casual city chic looks for a busy mom in a busy city at a busy time of the year. Cheers. So the first item that I have on is by Daydreamer. This is the Prince World Tour Weekend Tea. And this is in the color Dusty Lilac, extra small, $66.60 is the price. So for all you Prince fans out there and another quick story, when I was a kid, my dad worked for General Motors and he worked for a dealership and he ended up picking me up one day in Prince's limo. Sans Prince. Prince was not in the limo, but they were fixing his limo for uh, a concert he was doing locally. And I will never forget that. I was, I couldn't have been more than seven or eight years old, but I took a tour in Prince's limo. So that's probably the closest I ever got to Prince, but still, I thought it was a fun and different story to share here. Um, 
so many years later. But this t-shirt has, if you are familiar with the song, When Doves Cry, the doves are on this t-shirt. So that's the front. And then the back, you can see the back. I'm not even sure what the back says. I literally just put it on. I think it says Prince. So when I do the um, editing of this, I will definitely take a better look. But I do believe it is the World Tour tee, like I said. So um, yes, the World Tour Weekend tee. So this is the t-shirt. And then on the bottom, these sweatpants are by uh, Z Supply. These are the Halden Jogger in Heather Gray, extra small. And these are also 6660. And these joggers, I have to tell you, they fit very, very comfortably. Like they just fit. Um, if you can see it's the front, here's the back. They're a little lighter weight than the other joggers I had on before, but these feel very, very nice too. They're very comfortable pockets. Um, just like a band at the bottom. Like the other ones that had actual elastic, this is just a band. It is elastic, elastic but just a band. Um, so comfortable, I'm not gonna lie, just to be hanging around the house and be a little stylish, but comfortable. Now, I'm going to switch it up. Um, I believe I have a hoodie I want to show you to put with these sweatpants. And then I'll switch it out for the jeans for the other two tops that were also in this outfit. So hang on and I'll be back with that in a few moments. Okay, I have switched the top. I'm still wearing the joggers from earlier. But this top is by Michael Stars. So this is the Kylo acid wash thermal hoodie in the color tide a size extra small and this is a hundred and fifteen and twenty cents so hundred fifteen dollars and twenty cents um, let me come closer so you can see it's like a the thermal like a thermal top so like a thermal knit in like this greenish color has the little um, drawstrings, has a hood, so there we go, it's the hood, and then it's just a regular um, hoodie, lightweight, very lightweight, it has the notch, it has like an open notch here, pretty much I would just say a touch longer in the back when I turn around, but almost the same length front and back, but just maybe a drop longer to cover the uh, tush area. But Michael Stars happens to be a very, very pricey brand. So anyone that's looking at this saying $115, this is a pricey brand. Um, but comfortable, cozy, um, that's it. Um, but if you hang on, I'm going to switch it up and I'll be back with the um, jeans and I have two more tops. So I'll be back with that in a few moments. Okay, back and still in outfit two. And I adjusted my blinds to let a little bit more light in because I realized it's getting awfully dark in here and it's like 12 noon so I don't know why it was so dark but um, I think we should be better now the, on top this is by rails so this top and rails is yet another very pricey brand um, this is the Re Ramona varsity pullover and the pattern is white metallic stripes size extra small and this is 124.20 so I want you to see I'm gonna try to come in a little closer so again these metallic stripes so you've got like rose gold gold and silver and it's sparkly and then just on this white base and if you can see through I was wearing a 
red sports bra today, like a maroon sports bra. So sorry if that's showing through at all on your camera. Um, so, and paired on the bottom, now I have the jeans on. So these jeans are by Seven for All Mankind and they are the Josefina, um, and they're 178.20. So I believe these are a straight leg. So pockets here and they actually, they fit. I am shocked because I see that they are a size 25 and I actually have room if I turn around. I have room in them. So like I'm usually a 26 and especially in Seven for All Mankind, I'm usually having to size up. So these seem to have some extra room in them. So that's pretty good. But again, a little pricey. Um, pockets again in the front. Pockets in the back. And I am not sure you can see the length, but I'll put my leg up and they have it cuffed. So they're pretty, um, they have room at the ankle. They're not a skinny. They're like, I guess they're skinny up to a certain point and then they come out a little bit. So it's like a straight leg. So if you can see how long they would be, but they cuffed them twice. So I have them cuffed how they were in the box. You can see how they look with the sweatshirt. Um, cute outfit, pricey, but cute. Um, I actually have one more top to try on. Um, but before I get there, I just want to again mention if I didn't the length of this. So these, I believe, are like a mid-rise. They don't seem to be high-rise. They're just at my belly uh, button, the jeans. But the top, if I lift my arms up, does come up a bit. Um, so, and there's the back. But... So that's, that's that. I'm going to switch that top out and finish off outfit two before we head to outfit three. So hang on. Okay, last top in outfit two. So this is by Line and Dot, and this is the favorite off the shoulder. It's in the black tie-dye print, size extra small, and it is $81. So before I get further into this top, I did want to mention, because I didn't mention it before with the jeans, the jeans are button. Um, they're button up, in case anyone was wondering. I didn't get to that before. But, um, so I have the top on, and they say it's like, it's supposed to be worn more like this. And I, ha I actually have on my um, strapless um, walk hole, uh, red carpet bra that I got a while ago from Macy's. So here is the top with the jeans. It has like an elastic band down here. I really like the tie dye print. It's very, um, it's a very fun, colorful print. And let's come closer so you can see. So it has like a little cuff at the sleeve slims at the, the uh, wrist area I should say and again it's, that's the length in the front and here is the length in the back so it's a cute top um I think it looks good with the color jeans um these gray color but uh you let me know you've seen two of the three outfits so far so I'm going to switch in a minute and I will be back with outfit three. So hang on. Okay, we are back with outfit number three. And I have three of the four items on for this third outfit. So in the third outfit, my stylist note, she said, loving these leggings, a fantastic addition to your wardrobe, a new neutral in leggings. Olive is such a versatile color that pairs with just about everything. You are going to reach for these all the time. The concert tee can be worn with jeans and with leggings layered under both those tops, both the tunic 
and the sweatshirt are comfy and cozy and ready to snuggle up with the girls for projects and some cuddle time. So I do have on one of the tops. I have on the uh, band tee underneath and the leggings. So let's discuss. So on top I have, and this I believe is by uh, Varley. So this is the Varley Bayless sweatshirt and this is in the color chocolate and extra small and there is no price on my price sheet. So hang on a sec. I'll be right okay. Back. I opened the website on my phone and this sweatshirt is normally $148, my price $133.20. So the prices I've been giving you, by the way, are my price with the um, discount with my styling pass, um, the 10% um, applied. By the way, I know that might have sounded confusing, but all the prices up to this point were with my style pass. So this, again, $133.20, and this is in that chocolate color and it is Varley, and Varley is another expensive brand, and I do have leggings in the past from the Trend Send box, and I also have um, like a sweatshirt jacket from them as well, and their clothes are really, really nice. So, let me come closer so you can see the color, and this is so soft. I can't even begin to tell you how soft this is, um, I know it looks like a plain sweatshirt, but when I back away, I don't know if you can see, there are zippers, there's a zipper here, and there's a zipper here on this side. So there is zippers on both sides, um, and I have a step stool here only just to be able to pull my leg up so you can see the, um, legging color and, you know, more below, but, um, see the length? So see how long it is in the front. It has that notch, comes up a little bit, and then it's pretty long in the back. So it comes, definitely my, my tush is here and it keeps going and it goes um, below. So it's like a tunic length. Um, really, really comfortable. Now the leggings are also by Varley. Let me get my phone. I'd rather use my phone for this, to be honest. Um, I have the Whitney leggings on. They're in the olive color, extra small, again, Varley, normally 88, my price 79.20. So you can see the olive color, just a plain legging, um, but their leggings are very soft as well. Um, let me see if I can lift so you can see. They come up pretty high. Um, so there's the height in the front. There's the height in the back. And a comfortable, comfortable outfit. So underneath, I have the band t-shirt on. So let me take this off and I'll be back with that band t-shirt. Okay, so here is the next band t-shirt. So this is the third and the final in this box. So this band t-shirt is the CCR Bad Moon Rising Tee. So, for those of you who are familiar, this is Creedence Clearwater Revival, um, and it looks like the band tee is from 1969, older than me. I was born in 1977, so, but um, I do love this band. I do listen to their music. I'm into classic rock, so I am familiar with the band. Um, but here it is, and it's in this... Um, they're saying suede color, size extra small, and again, this is by Let Love. Normally $68, my price $61.20. So, come closer so you can see the print. And then back up so you can see the length. Again, just a regular band tee, but just comfortable and, you know, for hanging around and being comfortable at home, you know, working or doing whatever I need to do. But there is one more item and it is, I believe by Michael Stars, it's a sweatshirt. So if you hang on, I'm going to put that on and I'll be back with that last item. 
Okay, I'm back with the final and last item in the box and in outfit three. So this top is the Marcy tie-dye thermal tunic. Um, come closer so you can see the color. So it is in like a dark, like a black and a gray tie-dye print. And now I'm gonna back up so you can see the full length of it. And by the way, this they said is oxidi uh, color, extra small. Michael Stars is the brand. It's normally 108. My price, 97.20. So here is the full length of it. And it comes up on the side. Longer in the back, comes down pretty far below my uh, tush area. Same length, I'd say, in the front and the back, but it does come down in the back as well. So definitely a tunic length. And if I come closer, I just want you to see, it's in like a thermal type print. I don't know if you can see, yeah, there we go. So it's like thermal, the material, but, and it has like that slouched, so it has this slouched turtleneck, which I'm not a fan of things being this high, but it's not too tight so I think it's okay um yeah it's comfortable it's cozy um and that's pretty much it for this box um I do want to say as far as a wrap-up that with Transcend if you keep four items out of the box you get an extra 10% so all the prices that I listed to you were already 10% off with my style pass for the year but if I keep four items out of this box I would get 10% off of those four or more that I keep so four starting at four or more you get 10% off so please let me know you've seen me try everything on in this box I'd love to hear your feedback remember I know some of the prices are indeed you know up there but I am looking at keeping these items and having my family put a couple under the tree for me. So let me know which your favorites were on me in this try on. For those who are subscribers and have returned, thank you so much for all your uh, loyal support, your friendship, and more. For those who are not subscribers, please hit the subscribe button below. If you are not a uh, Transcend member, please feel free again to use my link in the comments to get yourself an extra 20% off your first box. And now I just want to say it is the holiday time. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, and have a magical day. Bye for now.